society faces important environmental challenges. Just 3% of water on the planet is fresh water, and only about 1% is readily available for human use. Greenhouse gas emissions increase the Earth's temperature. Industrial pollution and toxic emissions endanger ecosystems and clean water reserves. Important metals, needed for electronics and machines, are becoming scarce. In households all across the world, many natural resources are consumed every day. Humankind is already using nearly 50% more natural resources than the Earth can replenish. If everyone on the planet had a European lifestyle, we would need nearly three planet Earths to supply the entire consumption. If this trend continues, by 2050 people are predicted to be using twice as many natural resources as the Earth can provide. The protection of freshwater resources by implementing water efficiency is crucial. To do so, efforts must focus on energy efficient investment, because this will be the swiftest way to reduce CO2 emissions while helping to save money. Solving these environmental issues increasingly becomes a responsibility of the producing industry, since it is a main origin of these environmental problems and a large consumer of fossil fuels and mineral reserves. To understand to what extent an industry contributes to various environmental issues, products can be screened using life cycle assessment. This is a technique to assess the environmental impact of a product's life cycle. In life cycle assessment, all stages of a product's life are taken into account. Resource use, material processing, product manufacturing, distribution, use of the product, and end of life operations. Life cycle assessment has been standardized by the International Organization for Standardization and gives us the opportunity to measure how the life cycle of a product contributes to an extensive set of environmental indicators. These are grouped in damage to human health, damage to ecosystem quality, and resource depletion. This way, products can be compared by using specific environmental themes. This allows us to answer questions like, which product has the lowest impact on climate change? Or, which product is most toxic to humans? Life cycle assessments shows in which life cycle stage environmental impacts are highest and can even assess individual steps in the production process. This way, companies can decide how to improve the environmental performance of their product. Results can be used for marketing purposes, like product A has a lower environmental impact than product B and C. Or for R&D, we know how we can improve the sustainability of this product. Sustainable development is the most important challenge of the future, and life cycle assessment gives important conclusions on how to make industries more sustainable. Those who think of tomorrow today will think well of tomorrow, responsible and positive thinking, which will contribute towards leaving a cleaner world to our children and grandchildren.